Welcome everyone, Jason here from Mystical Tomes, and today we're going to be doing a reaction trailer to Wanted Dead Official Valentine's Day trailer. This is from IGN, because I want to give them the proper respect. This is actually a reaction trailer only, and I have no ownership or claim any ownership of this video. Strictly IGN. Also, I want you to go and visit the channel as well, give them the same love you guys show me every single day, and the freaking support. I get amazing comments. Uh, I'm actually going to be doing a reaction on comments that will be... On the next video so if you want to see that stay tuned and as always let's get started Inspector Mills. an unknown strike team attacked dower synthetics I'd like to tell you about a so this almost feels like a cyberpunk cyber city kind of game right now I don't know anything about it so this actually looks good so far how many too many. Gear up. Here they come. Interesting. So that's kind of cool that you actually get to choose guns or blades. I would personally use uh, blades uh, if I was a master at it because a master swordsman can do a lot in a short range distance than a gunman can. Just my personal opinion. You guys let me know. Um, but yeah, no, I personally think that these guys did a phenomenal job at this so far. I love the brutality on this. It almost has a Mortal Kombat vibe or, you know, a Soul Calibur vibe. Also a Resident Evil vibe. I really do like the slow motion finisher moves that they have on there. That's actually a little bit of an extra, uh, just a little bit of extra detail that you don't really see in a lot of games. I mean, you see them sometimes on, um, you see them on uh, sometimes on Devil May Cry finisher moves like that, but or Final Fantasy. But on this one, it's actually just a good thing to see on a on a different style of game. I also like that you have a choice to choose between guns and blades, like I said earlier. And on top of that, hopefully you get to uh, basically. Customize your character. That'd be also a nice little trait there as well. But yeah, so far so good. More male nudity in your stories than in a Joaquin Phoenix flick. Hey. Wow. A lot of brutal finishing moves on here. I was not expecting that. What can I say? I'm a sensual guy. Oh, shut the f up, Hatsuk. Yeah, shut the fuck up, fat sook. No, excuse my language. But anyway, that was actually a really good game. I actually really liked it. Uh, it was a different take on stuff. I mean, I don't know anything about the game or video or movie about it. But from a first like first reaction, uh, there's a lot to digest. I mean, you guys could be a mercenary group. You can be assassins for all I know. Or you could be a security detail or a gang, a gang uh, syndicate. But... All in all, I have to say, well done on it. The graphics looked amazing. The fight scenes, the choreography of fighting was really good. I love the finishing moves. The brutality kills, that's what I call them, the really gory kills where it's a, you know, a close to, like, just point-blank gunshot to the head or when someone is, you know, about to get back on their feet, they just decapitate them with just a clean cut. It would look amazing. It really did. And there, it seems to be having a lot of deep storyline in that as well. So... Uh, I'm not trying to overread it. From what I saw in a minute and a half trailer, looked phenomenal. Uh, if you guys want to research this more, I'm going to research this more, and I'll probably even check out the um, the next trailer here, and we can go on from there. But uh, as always, I'm Jason from Mystical Tomes, and I will see you guys in the next video. It'll probably be this next trailer right here as well. So stay tuned.